Welsh art figures have condemned a council's plans to cut funding to two of the nation's best known menus. Cardiff Council wants to reduce the funding um, give, uh, funding it gives to St David's Hall and the new theatre by 530,000 a year. St David's Hall um, is Wales's only purpose-built concert hall, is currently subsided around 1.2 million a year and new theatre is getting a grant of around 800,000 a year. Owen Hughes, founder of the Welsh Proms, said it would be a tragedy if the future of the concert, concert hall was put in jeopardy. It is the only purpose-built theatre in Wales and has been a tragedy if the country was left without a single one, he said. It's regarded as one of the finest purpose-built concert halls around and the artists all love it, as do the audiences who really appreci appreciate the great lines of sight and the amazing acoustics it has. Whilst Welsh actor Wynne Calvin has performed at the New Theatre like, with the likes of Shani Bassey, um, said this, this is more than sad because of 100 years the New Theatre has been on a focal point of both culture and entertainment in Cardiff. Russell Goodway, the city's finance bosses, said we are trying to find an outside provider who would be prepared to take the venues over. Um, there's more optimism about finding a company to take over New Theatre, however not so much optimism about someone taking over St David's Hall. However, bosses are talking to Live Nation, the firm that runs the Moat Point Arena, and about the possibility of taking over the New Theatre, and also talking to the Wales Millennium Centre about taking on the shows currently put on in St David's Hall. With this being in one of the long line of changes in the Welsh arts, we ask ourselves how bleak is the future of the theatre in South Wales?